Preston Pearson played in five Super Bowls with three different teams, Baltimore in 1969, Pittsburgh in 74, and Dallas in 77, winning the last two. This weekend, he saw his son Matt play Division I basketball for the first time. Matt starts for Drexel. He's seen where I've come from as far as high school and junior college, so I think it, how, no matter how I play, he'll be proud of me. I'm extremely proud of, of Matt, extremely proud of what he's done. And uh, Of course, being his dad, I know from whence he came, uh, as a scrawny 120-pound, 5'2-inch kid, uh, and he's come a long, long way. Matt transferred to Drexel from Holland County Community College. He was a junior college all-conference selection. This, after being cut from his high school team in his junior year. To see him now versus the time that he had extremely hurt, extremely hurt about it, uh, and even though he wasn't a very good basketball player, in my mind, he should have still made the ball club. But that may have been uh, the time that really got him going. Between his junior and senior years, Matt grew six inches and gained 50 pounds. At 6'3", 180, he still wasn't ready for Division I basketball. He's not your typical junior college player where his grades were bad in high school, so he had to go to junior college to get his grades up. He was a very good student coming out of high school. It was almost in reverse. 
he went to junior college, I think, to, to get more exposure as a basketball player. What interests me in leaving Texas is because they, they love football so much. And uh, I had troubles with that because I wanted to go to a place where they appreciated their basketball and basketball was number one. And since Drexel doesn't have a football team, uh, basketball had to be number one. Basketball is number one. There wasn't much chance of Matt playing football. Size was a factor. But now that he's big enough? When you see those players get hit, I just, <laughs> I don't know, because I'd want to lay on the ground and just, you know, like, wow, that was a great hit. You know, I, I couldn't bounce up right away and get in a huddle and, you know, look to get hit again. That's just, that's not me. Sound like an intelligent young man. <laughs> With today's victory, Drexel is in sole possession of first place in the North Atlantic Conference, maybe looking ahead to the NCAAs. At Drexel, Bill Perry, Sports Sunday, the 10 o'clock news.